Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and we're going to take a look at something that I often have a question about um, but this one is a little different. So it has to do with Windows updates but Windows updates that are optional and kind of hidden. So in Windows 10 when you go to your settings go to the Windows update and security you will possibly not everybody sees that, but there is a possibility that under check for updates, you have view optional updates. And if I click personally here, it gives me driver updates, but they're hidden again. You have to click to have them open up. And here you see Intel system, Intel net, Intel USB, Logitech, Realtek semiconductor. So these are driver updates that exist and at the top it says if you have a specific problem one of these drivers might help otherwise automatic updates will keep your drivers up to date what does that mean it simply means that the updates you see here they're not mandatory you don't have to apply them they don't change anything um, in security they do not have any impact for most people. So they stay hidden and they are just there because they exist. And if you would have a problem, they could maybe fix that problem. And so how do you know what problem? This is a little more tricky, but it depends on your computer. So for example, say I would have problems with my uh, graphics adapter. Um, Video is not playing right or blank or dark or my screen flickering or you know weird artifacts on the screen that aren't supposed to be there then maybe having the Intel display driver applied here might fix such a problem um, all sorts of weird effects weird things you know some of them are very general here you see uh, Intel system update and that's it well this Intel system update is probably drivers for the basic um, Intel chips that are on that mini PC that I have here. Um, another one is, for example, okay, here's m mobile fifth generation Intel Core host bridge. Once again, this is very specific to the, uh, I f the i5 fifth generation that exists here. Um, it could be uh, Intel USB. If you have USB port problems, for example, then you could apply the Intel USB update. Uh, Logitech uh, HID class, which is Anything that is a mouse, uh, keyboard, uh, and so on, trackpad. Now, the question that a lot of you have also concerning this is, should I install these when they are available? In my personal um, you know, uh, words on updates, I, I say it all the time here, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, applies to these updates also. If they were really important, they actually would not be hidden. The real important updates, they actually appear in Windows updates when you check for updates and they want to be installed. They're not going to be, you know, hidden updates or optional updates. They're just going to install because it's important to do so. These updates, you don't have to. And if your PC doesn't have any glitches, any problems, don't apply them. Leave your PC alone. Drivers are one of the big culprits of unstable systems. Blue screens, freezes, stuttering, all sorts of weird things happening. Drivers are a big chunk of why this happens. A bad driver can just render your PC completely unusable. And that's why when you've got stable drivers, when everything works, nothing ever crashes, nothing ever goes wrong, stay away from them even if they are there just leave them there it doesn't matter don't you know you ignore them that's all um that's what i do here with this machine i'm not installing these drivers they're already my this pc works great i don't need that so i would stay away from them unless you've got a specific issue and that specific issue can be addressed by one of the drivers there um, that is showing up in the optional updates if you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, 
Thank you for watching our videos.